Hi, and welcome to the Shady Designs podcast. In this episode, we're going to be talking about how to measure the drop of your ceiling pendant. So the drop is how long the suspension kit or the suspension rod needs to be. That's the space between the ceiling and the top of the lampshade. So normally what we say is the space that you need, so the clearance of the lampshade, should be at least two meters. So that allows your tallest friend to comfortably walk under the lampshade. If you're having the the ceiling pendant over a dining table, you can afford to have it a little lower because obviously you won't be walking under it. But then it doesn't give you the flexibility of moving the table out of the way. It means you're going to have to keep that table there and otherwise you're going to have this particularly low lampshade hanging. So the way that we measure the drop of the lampshade is we look at the floor to ceiling height and then we know that we need a space of two meters from the floor to the bottom of the shade. Now think about how tall your lampshade is going to be. Most often they're about 30 centimeters tall. So that's two and a half, uh, two, 2.3 meters from the floor to the bottom of the shade. The drop is the space between the ceiling and the 2.3 meter mark. If you've got any questions on figuring out your ceiling drop, you can speak to one of our designers here at 02 4658 or check out our um, examples on our blog attached to this podcast. You can also send your architectural plans in to us, info at shadydesigns.com.au. Thanks for listening. I hope this has been a bit of a help for you.